Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and this is night 266 of GameStop Dumpster Diving. As you guys can see, I have these Pokemon cards in my hand. Uh, they're not legit like trading cards, but they are Pokemon cards that you can redeem this Pokemon, and you can actually get it in your game or something. I'm not a huge Pokemon fan, so I really don't know. But all I know is that you guys can redeem this code, and these codes are still valid. I just scratched them when I was at my house, so these are fresh. They work. Why did I? Why am I going like this? 100%. They work. So I'm giving five of these away to you guys. The first five people, it's you guys are lucky. You guys have these uh, if you want them. If not, leave them for someone else to take them. There's code number one, code number two, and just pause the video whenever you guys want these. I love giving back to you guys, and I know there's a lot of Pokemon fans out there. There's number three, number four, and number five. So there you guys go. You guys can redeem these. These are definitely going to work 100% no joke because... Oh, the car. Give me one second. There's a car outside. Okay, they're gone. Sorry about that. They work 100% for sure, though, because they I just scratched them at my house, and they are valid until, like, August of 2017. So they're valid. They definitely work. And let's get into this. Tonight, it looks like there's two bags, and that's pretty much it. There's nothing new. This is the same spot I usually always go. Uh, there's this box here. Like, it's always here. And, yeah, just two new bags. Let's get into this. Those bags usually do very, very well because they're thicker material they're made out of, and they could hold heavier weight. So let's do the weight test. Let's see. I haven't touched them yet, so hopefully that one's heavier. I'm just hoping. Oh no, that bag's actually really heavy. That's a heavy bag. And then there's this one. Uh, that's pretty heavy too, but I don't know. This one might be heavier. Right, let's go into this one first and then get into that one. And before I get into the bag, can we hit a goal of 3,000, 3 or 4,000 likes this video? I know we can do it, Speed Squad, Speedy Nation, Speedy Army, whatever you guys want to be called, Speedsters, whatever, the Speedy family. I think we can do it. Let's just do it. Three or four thousand uh, view, uh, not views, three to four thousand uh, likes this video. I'd really appreciate it. Also, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe because I love making these videos. Daily videos, by the way, upload videos every single day. And let's jump into this. Looks like we have a box. A whatever it is, it's not in here. It has instructions. What is this? It's like a filter or maybe ink cartridge. That's what it could be. I don't want it though because I don't want it. <laughs> there's nothing inside of it. Also, there's a Pokemon. Oh, it's just the top of the Pokemon card. Thing. A lot of packaging material. Oh, I see something. Oh, it is an ink cartridge or ink thing. Yeah, it's an ink thing. That's exactly what this is. It's an ink. This would have been in the box, actually. There are so many cards back here tonight, and there's also a lot of planes. Oh my god. But uh, either way, yeah, there's. This is an ink thing. I don't want that, though. I don't want to get inky fingers, which I kind of already did a little bit. But either way, uh, looks like we have. Oh, these are really heavy. So that's kind of heavy. It's not that heavy because it is empty, probably. But it, uh, it's just a little decently heavy. There's also this, which is pretty heavy, all weekly ads. And that would have been the box, by the way, that the ink cartridge probably would have went in. So that's what I'm going to assume. That's what I thought it was. A bunch of boxes. I'm covering the other bag. I know, I know. But I'm going to move everything once I get to that bag over there. And uh, let's see what else. Okay, another card just passed. If you guys ever see me just stop, it's usually because I'm looking at cars. And I'm like, I don't know if they're going to come up to me or if they want to say, like, hey, what's going on? <laughs> like, I have no clue. It looks like we have a... This is freaking heavy. I do find these time to time. These are those books for like you can buy packaging material like bubble wrap uh, Whatever that is like saran wrap to like tie stuff up I don't know exactly what it's called but like stuff like that. It's a uline booklet. It is freaking thick Like it's so heavy too. It's extremely heavy I'm actually just gonna throw that up there because I really don't want that and I don't want to just throw it over there But uh, yeah, so that was really heavy sadly. Ah, that was probably all the weight in that oh, broken rubber band, too. Like, I've been finding tons of broken rubber bands lately. It's so disappointing. We have it. this gift cards I never find money on, just to let you guys know. If you guys are like, oh my god, look at all these gift cards. There's tons of gift cards. I've never found any money on them. Anything in this? Nope, nothing. Uh, let's see what else. Let that focus back in for a second. There we go. And let's get into this a little more, I guess. We already kind of got into it a bunch, but you never know what you're going to find. Like, this oh, that's the bottom of half of that Pokemon card deck thingamajiggy. Always go to the bottom, you never know what you're going to find. 
like this razor. Oh my God, it's a box cutter. That's all it is, but I'm gonna throw this in this box because I don't wanna touch it. I don't wanna accidentally move stuff and cut my hand. So that, as you guys can tell, I'm very safe. I don't just like rip my hand in there and just go like this and stuff. Well, I just did, but if there's like stuff in there because I can harm you and cut you, obviously. Obviously nothing in bag number one, but uh, yeah, and I threw it off to the side so I didn't get cut later if I was to go rip this bag over this ways. And yeah, this bag's actually really heavy. Uh, let's see what's inside. Let's see. I always love finding these bags too, just because like they're like they're, they're GameStop and there's guaranteed to be stuff in these bags. I have never found a bag like this without anything good in it. For the most part that I can remember, maybe I have found a bag like this, maybe once or twice that hasn't had anything in it. But for the most part, these bags are usually really good. Let's dive in. And they're just a little hard to open. And I see, oh my God, Grand Theft Auto 5. And I see a clip or something black. What is this? It's a black clip suction cup. No, what is, ooh, what is it? This looks like it, is this like electronic? I don't know what this is. It's a wireless headset. That's not a headset. Maybe it's a headset stand. It looks like you actually plug something into it. I, mean, I got some ink on my hand, by the way, from the ink cartridge, but whatever, it doesn't matter. That's all in the game of dumpster diving. It looks like you put like a little plug right there, like a little, de like a little, uh, uh, what are those called? Those little plugs or whatever that go into the wall. And it looks like it charges a wireless headset. I don't know what headset this is too, though. Maybe we'll find the headset in the bag. That would be amazing. But that's pretty cool. I need a trusty, dusty box now, though. Uh, I don't, you know what? I'm just going to keep it right. Mm, no, I do need a trusty, dusty box. You know what? Let me dump this stuff. Okay. And now I can use this box. The... I've actually used this box once before, like I think a week ago or something, <laughs> the same box. But either way, that's the trust issue box for tonight. Throwing it in that corner. Grand Theft Auto. Ooh, we have a case on top too. Ooh, these are always great to find because uh, I can put little CDs in these. Or just a regular, it looks like it's a little wet. But I mean, hey, whatever, dried off with paper towel. It doesn't matter. can still use it. Grand Theft Auto 5 for the PS4. It is heavy. I don't know if the manual or map is in there. I know this game comes with a map. Okay, no game, sadly, but there is a map. It's always fun to find the Los Santos Blaine County map. That is freaking awesome. I like that. Grand Theft Auto 5 for the PS4. Let that focus in. Three, two, one, focus. No, it just doesn't want to focus. That usually helps. There we go. Three, two, one. Grand Theft Auto 5. Dun, dun, dun. Still a great case. It looks like it clips. It sounds like it clips. What else do we have? So far, this bag has been pretty good. Got an adapter for a headset or like a headset stand or something. Oh, there's also a little... I didn't even see this. You can plug something into the back of it. Oh. Okay, maybe it's for like a PS3 or PS4 or something. I don't know, but it's for a headset. That's what it said. Uh, we have some of these for Nintendo Switch. These are brand new, by the way. These are, well, NBA 2K something, not too sure, but those are just cover art kind of deals. It looks like we have a bag in a bag. Oh my God. If you guys know from my older videos, bag in a bag is such a great sign. We have two bags in, oh wait, ooh, ooh, what is this? Oh, I know exactly what this is. This is a Wii U charging stand. That's exactly <laughs> A Wii U charging base, charging stand, whatever you want to call it. A little standy thingamajig. Let that focus in. Let's see if that'll help. It goes away and then it goes in. So, there we go. Actually, a lot better. So, yeah, uh, pretty cool. I do find these very, very often for the Wii U, but still really cool. I'll take it. Seems like there's some more things. I'm just going to dump them out in the box. Looks like we have the one that's not chargeable. It's just a regular stand and a couple of these little feet ones as well, which are pretty cool. I love finding those. Uh... It looks like we have another bag with a Wii stand in it. <laughs> Always finding Wii stand. I have to say, the most... It's stuck. Hold on. It was, like, glued to the bottom of it. The things I find the most when I dumpster dive in game at GameStop or whatever is the Wii charging... Oh, just the Wii stand. That. And also the Wii charging stand and these black pieces too i always always find those not every single night but i have over like probably a hundred of those just stacked up i have no clue what to do with them so many oh we got some manuals in here we have this. this is the marketing book for gamestop don't really want to keep that kind of cool cover art but a couple pamphlets for we fit plus and also we sports resort didn't i just find this i think i did i don't know but either way a couple of those pretty cool looks like we have a Wii manual as well, which is really heavy, so I probably made this really heavy. Is this the thing for the headset? That'd be awesome. No, this is for the Wii. Wii nunchuck. I don't know. It would have been, what, I guess you buy a nunchuck, and maybe the nunchuck's in here. Oh, no top. Oh, is that the nunchuck? What is this? Oh, no, it's a Wii. <laughs> that is so funny. It was a smushed up Wii controller skin. 
I'll definitely take that. That's pretty awesome. It's a black one. I don't find too many black ones. I find a lot of clear ones. It doesn't look like it's really cut anywhere, which is pretty sweet. I'll take that for sure. Ooh, ooh, what is that? And what the hell is this? That is like sanitation lotion stuff. I don't know. What is this? Whoa, it's really dusty. What is this though? It's a, I've actually found one of these before. I've only ever found one of these. This is for your uh, Connect, I believe, right? Your Xbox 360 Connect and you put it on and it like zooms it in and stuff or something like that. I'm not too sure like the specs of it and whatnot, of what it actually really does, but it might zoom in or zoom out, but this is like the Nyko. Yeah, it is really dusty and gross and grimy though. Oh, it's like really baked on. Damn, that is freaking dope though. That is so cool. I've only found one of these ever. It's so cool to find stuff that I don't find often. So that is really freaky. A lot of like weird accessory kind of things tonight, which is really cool. I don't mind finding stuff like that. Got a spoon. Can't forget about that spoon. Oh, I see another car. Like I said before, if I ever pause, it's because I'm looking at a car or something. Gorilla Glue. Whoa, that's like brand new. It's spilled a little on the outside, but that's seriously like brand new. It's still liquidy. Oh, that is cool. Gorilla glue can be expensive. So I mean, I mean, maybe like five bucks or something, but still for free. I'm gonna take that. Gorilla glue. What? <laughs> that is so random. I'll take that. That is sweet. I've never found gorilla glue. I thought it was disc cleaner. Usually I have found a uh, like scratching, like stuff to clean like your uh, CDs if they're really scratched and whatnot. It's called like disc cleaner, but I've never found a uh, Gorilla Glue or let alone glue, I don't think so. That looks like it's it for that big. Let's do a mini recap really fast. Tonight was a great night. It was really a freaking epic night. Uh, I found two uh, manuals here for Wii Fit Plus and Wii Fit Resorts. We have a Wii stand. Uh, a lot of Nintendo stuff, just a hell of a lot of Nintendo stuff I find. I really do. The Wii U stand. Give me a second. Let's see if this will clean up a little bit, be a little clearer. There we go, just a little clearer. Uh, we have the, uh, I guess I'll go through the Wii U stuff first. Wii U charging stand, base thing. A couple of these, like a little feedy thingamajiggies. Uh, PS4 Grand Theft Auto 5, which has the map inside. I don't know if the manual, yep, it looks like the black manual is inside as well. Let's see if it clips. It clips on both sides, that is awesome. Also, one of these for just to hold the CD. Gorilla Glue, extremely freaking random. Never found it before. A Wii skin, a lot of Wii stuff, wow. And Wii U stuff. Uh, this thing for the Xbox 360, which was the only Xbox 360 find tonight, the Nyko Zoom thingamajiggy or whatever it's called. Uh, also, we have the thing for a headset apparent. This is a wireless headset. So I'm gonna assume it's for maybe just a headset for something. I don't know, I have no clue. Maybe a afterglow, I don't know. It would probably say it on the bottom of that though. If you guys know what that is for, please let me know in the comment section down below. I would highly, highly appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to drop a like, comment, subscribe. Can we hit 4,000 likes this video? Like I said in the beginning, three or 4,000 would make my year, my day, my month amazing. Thank you guys so much. You can watch the last dumpster dive over there, most recommended video over there. Subscribe to the Speedy Gamer, my gaming channel. Subscribe to the Speedy Diver. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys really, really enjoyed. Uh, I hope you guys have a spectacular day, night, evening, uh, whatever, wherever you are. Just have a great day, I guess. I don't know how to say that, really. But I hope you guys are just doing well. Thank you guys for watching. I love each and every one of you. You guys are amazing. And I'll catch you guys on the flip side.